right, so this is Mocha. Mocha is about three years old. We got her from a pretty bad uh, breeding sort of situation down a little bit south of us. And as you can tell, this poor little girl is very timid, very scared. She's actually doing really well now compared to where, how she was a few weeks ago. Um, she just came to us completely terrified. She, it was obvious she had very little human contact and definitely very little positive human contact. Uh, but she's really warmed up to us now. She's being a little bit camera shy right now. Um, but she's now gotten to the point she's getting used to living in a house and wags her tail and loves to hang out with the other dogs. Um, poor Mocha here was bred so many times, she had a very difficult spay surgery. She was just spayed a few days ago, and uh, she just was horribly, horribly overbred and also very malnourished when she was bred. So, as you can see, she was, did not have the strength to be able to take care of her last litter of puppies. So we're very glad that she's with us right now. Unfortunately, she's the product of a really bad start to life where she was just used as a puppy mama. Um, but we're going to get her all fixed up now. She's in a much better place and she will eventually get adopted out into a wonderful home. Um, we're gonna keep her, uh, you know, we've already had her about three weeks. I'm gonna keep her at least another three weeks. Uh, again, the, the place that she was at was not in a home. It was not a normal breeding operation at all. Um, she most likely was living outside in some pretty poor conditions and very under-socialized. So we're going to keep her for at least another few weeks so she can decompress, learn a little bit more about what it's like to be a dog that lives in a home, and then she'll, she'll get adopted. So she's here on some mental healing right now besides just her physical healing.